In today's video, I'll be showing you how to view your FPS and network receive in Roblox on your Windows computer. So the first thing that you need to do to check these statistics out is to launch up Roblox. Once you have Roblox open, you now need to hold down shift on your keyboard. So this is the key with the up arrow and you then need to press F5, which is along the top of your keyboard. You will now notice in the top left hand corner a few different statistics. So as you can see at the top, we have our FPS, we then have our physics and then render and then network receive. So the FPS is just how many frames per second you are currently getting in game. And as you can see, I'm getting 60, it sometimes goes down to 59, which is absolutely fine because the maximum you can use within Roblox is 60 FPS unless you use some sort of FPS unlocker. Below we then have our physics and then render, which is all to do with the FPS. And then at the very bottom there, you can see network receive. So at the moment mine is in the red, which means it's not that good. You have green, orange and red. Ideally you want it to be in the green. So there can be many reasons to why yours is currently in the orange or red. It could be that you're using a wireless connection, someone is currently streaming or downloading on your internet connection, and things like that, which I will cover in another video. So if you haven't subscribed yet, then be sure to subscribe if you'd like to see that video. As you can see, mine has now gone back to green, and then straight away it's gone back down to orange. So it can sometimes alternate the network receive. It does just depend, like I said, what is currently happening with your network. Below, you do also have a few more statistics about your network. Mine currently all has question marks, but yours might be slightly different to mine. So that does now bring me to the end of this video. That is how you view your FPS and network receive. The statistics below network receive does just come up after a certain period of time, like you can see then, and then that window will disappear as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video and it helped you out. If you did like this video, then click the like button below. And if you'd like to see more computer sluggish videos, then click that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.